Hi everyone, I'm Khushi Sharma. Today I'm going to discuss regarding thin and thick line which has been around so many decades in the information system. In this video, I'm going to talk uh, in favor of thin line. Firstly, we'll discuss in brief about what is thick and thin line and later I will explain why I think thin line is better than thick line. A client has a basic hardware configuration and is defined as a program that runs on the local machine by requesting service from the server. It is divided as thin client and thick client. A thin client is a lightweight computer that has been significantly simplified and network optimized with little computing power that relies on the resources of the host computer. Thin client doesn't have the storage capability to store users' data, so they store data at a remote server from which the thin client is connected to. A thick client, which is also called as a fed client or rich client, is a practical PC that ends up interfacing with a server and has its own working framework programming, handling, capacities and neighborhood stockpiling allowing it to keep working with no issues while disconnected. <clears throat> a thin client application enables companies set up new workstation for remote or in-house employees at uh, a much lower cost than providing every employee with a new hardware. They centralize security by securing various thin client connected uh, softwares. Thin client are divided into two types. One is thin client software and the other one is thick client hardware. The software part is simply an application that runs on any available host and can use some of the features of the local host such as hardware-based graphic to better render the remote client's user interface. And hardware computer are basically devices explicitly designed to run the thin client software. Thin client can be mainly used in three ways. Firstly, it can be used as desktop you know, virtualization where resources can be accessed from any device connected to the server and as long as a device can connect it to the uh, server, it can utilize the resources running on it, which gives greater flexibility and agile deployment, secondly used as a uh, shared service, which uses uh, the same operating system and application because they are running from a central server, which benefit organization as uh, user activity can be restricted to using a specific secure and uh, a protected application and finally it is used as a browser based computing where the ordinary devices connected to the internet perform their application function in web browser rather than on a remote user data processing take place on their client computer but software and data are retrieved from the network Networks that include a thin client should be carefully designed with sufficient capacity and an appropriate topology, especially switch networking is recommended than uh, share media. Switch network, uh, switch network should be limited to few hundred thin clients and uh, their servers to avoid problem caused by too much broadcast. Traffic and are also recommended to be connected via routers. Server side programming runs on a server dealing with the generation of content of web page like querying the database, interact with other servers, structure web application, access write a file on server and process user input. Whereas client side programming runs on the client machine and deals with the user interface display and any other processing that can happen on client machine like reading, writing cookies. I feel a thin client approach to software architecture is better than thick client because network latency of thick thin client is fast and robust. Deployment is easier, generally consumes less uh, resources. Uh, overall, by using thin client, uh, the organization will have the following benefits. 
enhances security, easy manageability, cost savings, energy efficient, improved user product uh, productivity, remote work capacities, uh, sorry, capabilities. Some of the example where the client is used in current time from the software point are Office 365, Yahoo, message, Yahoo Messages, uh, Microsoft Outlook, all web browsers and web application like WP, Google Docs, and many online games and also search engines like uh, Google, Yahoo are the example of their client. Thank you so much.